It's an idea that me and Tommy came up with uh, actually 19 years ago. Uh, let's give the kids an opportunity to wrestle around here. There's great competition. What we like is the fact that there's teams from Warren County, Bergen County, and Morris County here that don't see each other during the regular season. So it gives kids the opportunity to wrestle with different individuals. Just talk about some of the teams here. you got some top-notch clubs. Well, we, you got Roxbury here, like usual. Um, actually, new schools. I mean, Kid Tinney's here, High Points here. Those are uh, some of the better programs. Uh, new teams include Garfield from Bergen County, Bloomfield from Essex County. So it, 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 we've, during the course of 19 years, we've had probably close to like 70, 80 schools involved at some point. You know, some chose to come back, some came for a couple of years, some didn't, you know, look, went different places. It seems like you have a good mix here of competitive wrestling in a nice, relaxed environment. It's not like the regions, people screaming and yelling. It's just everyone getting a good run out there in a nice environment. Well, what we do is we create a situation where we match up teams and we tell the coaches, we don't keep team score. We used to keep team score, have a trophy. It got to be a little bit like crazy. We stopped that probably about 15 years ago. Now it's like you match up kids by ability. That's what we tell the coaches. You, know, you match up your best kids. So they may be in different weight classes. One may be 116, 125 but match those kids up. They're getting the most out of it. You don't want a good kid to, to, to really beat up a, an inexperienced kid because that, that puts a sour taste in the kid's mouth and it's not promoting the growth of the sport. A lot of the coaches do a good job trying to match up their uh, uh, higher quality kids against, you know, so they get some good goes. Uh, but there's still a lot of, you know, newer kids and uh, JV con caliber kids that get some matches too, so it's good for them as well. It's real good also to introduce the uh, incoming freshmen to what high school wrestlers are like. Uh, they get to see some of the uh, bigger names in the area usually show up at least the first week. This week's Fargo, so some kids might be missing. But uh, it's real good uh, competition. It's laid back. It's good. The kids get good bouts. You can get two or three a night, so uh, it's real beneficial for us. Like Brad DeRupo said, the Opac on Duels have been around for a while, and Roxbury coach Jim Dolan has brought his team ever since he took over the Gales program. We've been coming here for a lot of years now, uh, you know, just, just trying to get some more action in the summer, some more wrestling, you know, besides our team camp and stuff like that. And... Uh, you know, everybody knows, you know, summer uh, wrestling makes winter champions. So uh, I know that's uh, a lot being said out there. So, you know, we, we come here to get some extra matches in. It's, you know, it's close by right next door to us. So uh, it works out really well, and they do a great job here. The wrestlers like coming here as well. They get a good match in a relaxed atmosphere, and they can work on things for the winter. You know, it really gives our team the opportunity to come out here and wrestle, you know, competitively. And it sees, uh, we are able to see how our team's going to be against local competition come winter. It's a great way to get back on the mat, get some challenges from all around the state. A couple of PA teams, I think, come here. So uh, just here today to rock and roll and uh, just win. Coach Eric Billette brings the Newton Braves here every year. It's great. Gets the kids involved over the summer. We usually try to get our kids here for both weeks so that uh, they get some mat time in before football and soccer start. So uh, it's been going on a long time. Not, I don't think I wrestled here, but it's been going on quite a while.